expressing likes and dislikes in Spanish. To say that you don't like to do something or that you don't like something that's singular, like a taco, you would say, me gusta, to say, I like, or you would say, no me gusta, which means I don't like. If you were talking about something that was plural, like tacos, you would say, me gustan, and if you didn't like them, you would say, me gust no me gustan. Now, me gusta and no me gusta are for things that are singular and actions. Me gustan and no me gustan are for plural. In today's lesson, we are going to be focusing on actions, saying that you like or don't like to do actions. Que te gusta hacer means, what do you like to do? If you're getting to know somebody, you know, you know, you may have learned in Spanish already how to say, what's your name, como te llamas, where are you from, de donde eres, well, the next logical question is, all right, what do you like to do? ¿Qué te gusta hacer? So to answer that question, you might say, oh, me gusta, and then you add an action word. Me gusta bailar, I like to dance. Or, me gusta correr, I like to run. You may say, me gusta Jugar videojuegos. I like to play video games. But this is all you have to do is me gusta and then put in a verb to express what you like to do. Now after you're done telling the person you're having the conversation with what you like to do, you can ask them what they like to do and instead of saying, que te gusta hacer, you can simply say, y a ti? which means, and you? Now this person's going to say, oh, a mi me gusta, and then tell you what they like to do. Might be dibujar, maybe it's going to be practicar deportes, but they're going to tell you something. If they agree with you, they're going to say, a mi también. También means also, okay? A mí también. Me gusta jugar videojuegos. Or me gusta correr. A mí también me gusta bailar. So if they agree with the things that you like to do, they're going to say, a mí también. Or they're simply going to say, a mí me gusta, and then tell you what they like to do. Now, if somebody asks, te gusta, te gusta means, do you like to do something? Do you? So, if a person says, te gusta cantar, do you like to sing? Or, Te gusta escuchar música. Do you like to listen to music? Or do you like, te gusta practicar deportes? Do you like to play sports? Well, there's two answers. There's the positive answer, which is, si, sí, me gusta practicar deportes. Or, me gusta escuchar música. Or, me gusta cantar. And then there is the negative response, which is, no, no me gusta practicar deportes. No, no me gusta escuchar música. Or, no, no me gusta cantar. The reason for the two no's, all right? The first no 
is for the answer, no. The second no is the no in the, that in English is in the don't, right? No, I don't. So no, no me gusta is how you answer in the negative. Now somebody may ask you a question that gives you options, like to find out what do you want to do more. You want to do this or this, right? And how you do that is you ask, que te gusta mas? Que te gusta mas? With the mas being best or most. What do you want to do most? Que te gusta mas? Trabajar o dibujar? Or esquiar o trabajar? Now, that wouldn't be too hard a uh, decision. Do you want to go ski? What do you want to do most? Ski or work, right? So you can answer that a couple of different ways. Um, if you like just one of them, you would say, Me gusta más trabajar. I like to work best. Or, me gusta más dibujar o esquiar, right? If you like them both, like you really don't have an opinion either way, you'd like them both the same, it would be, me gusta, ma, or me gusta los dos iguales. Me gusta los dos iguales. Now, if you don't like either of them, you don't like either one of the options, you would say, no me gusta ni dibujar, ni Trabajar. The knees mean neither nor. It's when you're listing things that you don't like, you say, no me gusta ni, and you fill in with an action, and ni, and you fill it in with another action. Now, I've uploaded this video to YouTube so that my students will have the opportunity to review this as many times as they need to, to understand the concept of speaking about what you like to do and don't like to do, how to find out what other people like to do and don't like to do. However, if you have questions about what you've seen in this video, you need some concepts uh, clarified, you know how to reach me at Senor Denim on Twitter.